Welcome to follow my first test of my unique rocket stove. So, this is the rocket stove. And uh, my project name for this is Wocket Stove, since I plan to use this for, for Wook. It's made out of bricks and it's got fire feed here. This is where we feed the, fire, the wood and here we have the ash tray to empty the ash and also to control the fire. On top it looks like this made out of welded iron and this one pan is just bought as it is. For this test we will use uh, some fire starters, some uh, biomass twigs you find in your garden. We will also try to use those pine cones that I have thousands of to see if it works. And uh, to uh, measure we will the effect I will use some uh, oil and a thermometer and I hope that I will get uh, about 180 to 200 Celsius because that's what I prefer for wok or deep fry. To start the fire I pull out the ashtray I have some fire starters here and then on top of those I will put, put these fine twigs to get the fire started. See, it's already smoking. So now I have some more twigs here and I can close the fire feed. And now the air will come in this way through the wood and up through the chimney. And the rocket effect is there, as you can see. So, time to put on the frying pan <coughs> and uh, I will also pour some oil on it and start the th th thermometer. Okay, so we have some oil and the thermometer is dipped in the oil and um, I'll take a look at the watch. So I filled it with some more twigs and uh, there is some smoke coming, maybe they were not completely dry. And the thermometer is at 60 Celsius soon. You can see the flames coming up. It's not heating the oil as fast as I would have suspected, but uh, okay, it's, it's soon 80. So we are at 10 minutes and it seems to have stopped at around 140 degrees. Fire is working nice. Flames are coming up here, but I, I guess that um, the wind and um, cools uh, cools the oil off. So um, okay, it's not a complete failure. Now it's even dropping a bit. I will try to feed 
feed it with the uh, pine cones and see if uh, something happens. So, so I tried to fill it up with pine cones and um, actually the, the temperature is rising. We are soon at 180 and that's good. Uh, we can also see that it's almost running backwards so I will close this one a little uh, no big deal but hmm, I can see we are now at 190 and as you can see the oil is smoking and uh, so it was a matter of the finding the fuel. Well, I have no food for testing, but I have those. The temperature is still rising, 220. Hmm, interesting. Also, the pan will get seasoned now. That's good. So, what's the conclusion of today's test? Well, um, pine cones seems to be the best fuel for this uh, hook rocket stove. Uh, I also think that with some training you can control the heat and not uh, overheat the oil as I did today. Um, so, I, I'm, I will, next time, I will definitely start with some small twigs and then go to the pine cones and uh, with uh, a thermometer in the oil and adjusting how many cones I put in uh, control the heat and the temperature so uh, all in all it's a success soon it's just ashes left and um, I'm happy with the wicket stove thanks for watching see you next time